Hey there guys. Today I want to talk a little bit about the problem that I had when I just started getting into astrophotography. That is I wanted to mount my mirrorless or DSLR camera to an equatorial mount. And there was a myriad of sort of jerry-rigged solutions that I found, but I really wanted something that was solid because I am putting, you know, a 600 millimeter lens on here with an extender. There's a lot of weight. Um, you're talking about seven, eight pound camera lens and camera body. And I wanted something that I had a lot of confidence in that was going to deliver a stable platform for clean, crisp images. Now, most of your equatorial mounts are going to use Los Mandy or Dovetail Vixen plates like this one. And what I first started with was this, uh, basically I put a Benro uh, B2 ball head mount on here with an Arca Swiss plate uh, because all of my camera attachment points use Arca Swiss. Uh, it's very secure. Uh, and this actually worked well for wide field astrophotography. Um, so like when I'm doing things like Barnard's Loop or the Milky Way or Northern Lights and things like that. Now this worked really well, but one of the major issues with this is that when you put a camera on the ball head mount and then you put it on here, you really can't use the ball head features to move to to your target. You really have to rely on the equatorial mount to slew in the right direction that you want it to because if you move this uh, ball head in any way, uh, when you first set up your equatorial mount, you're trying to balance in both the declination and the uh, right ascension on your equatorial mount so that everything runs smoothly and it tracks smoothly. And you really can't adjust your directionality on this ball head. And there's just opportunity for it to slip. Um, even when I would tighten it down a lot, when I was running a little bit heavier lenses, I would get a little bit of slippage or my mind just wasn't thinking and I would just reach up and grab and loosen up the ball head instead of adjusting um, on the equatorial mount itself using it to slew. So I ended up moving away from this and going with a different product. And that product here is this ADM uh, Dovetail to Arca Swiss adapter. So what I'll do is I'll go and actually just take that whole thing off and show you. And basically what this is, is it's a dovetail plate right here. And then you have an Arca Swiss plate that you can uh, loosen up right here. So it's really long, which is really nice um, for when I'm mounting my big Sony 200 to 600 lens on there. There's a lot of grab on that plate. And then I can just slide this into my equatorial mount and lock it in and that works really good uh, for stabilizing my whole camera setup. So I really like that solution. It's worked well for me. It's I've put seven, eight pounds on already and I've had no problem. And it's a great way to secure your DSLR mirrorless to your equatorial mount. All right guys, I'll see you next time. Clear nights, dark skies. Bye.